Well, if you're thinking of making a move, we have a warning tonight about some moving companies. The Better Business Bureau has received hundreds of complaints about items being severely damaged or disappearing altogether. Five in your side, Holden Kariki explains why it is so hard for many Missourians to get their money back. Moving is stressful enough, but Danny Williams Hobson had a little added pressure to get into her Maryland Heights home. And I was due in a month before uh, we had the baby. They hired a local mover to help, and Williams Hobson quickly noticed something wasn't quite right. We had a cush corner cushion that was completely ripped. It looked like um, they actually took a greasy um, tool and wiped it on the edge of one of our couches. Other stuff didn't show up at all. How does a whole bed go missing? David Florence had a similar experience after movers he hired to relocate his daughter from St. Louis to North Carolina showed up in a U-Haul with an unusual request. Well, Shipley says pay us at the end. We don't do that. If you want us to put the stuff on the truck and she's leaving in three hours to drive, pay us. He sent the movers nearly $1,300 only to have his daughter's stuff disappear. And she had all her furniture and then stuff from her youth, you know, that's her memories that are gone. She only had three pairs of shorts and one pair of shoes. Unsuccessful in his attempts to contact the company, he traced the truck, which was returned to Kansas City two days after pickup. He didn't go to Raleigh or wasn't near Raleigh when he said he was, so he was obviously lying to me. According to Sarah Wetzel at the Better Business Bureau, cases like this have become all too common. The Better Business Bureau, as of now, has about 226 complaints. Unfortunately, under Missouri law, companies are only required to refund 60 cents per pound of item moved. And it's hard to get your money back if something were to happen. It is frustrating because even though there are just things right there, your things, you know, you trust this company to get your things to your home safely. And Wetzel says you can protect yourself by paying with a credit card and getting everything in writing, but she suggests another step. Look at getting an insurance policy yourself on these items. It's always very important to ask the moving company if they have an insurance policy, but push them to prove it. At KSDK, we're focused on telling stories in your community. So if there's something newsworthy taking place where you live, send us an email to tips at KSDK.com. Reporting in St. Louis, Holden Kerwicki, five on your side.